Hello everyone, um, back in town. Reason tonight is um, Brian Old Ore Street, well Brian Mr Old Ore Street is out and about tonight helping the homeless. I want to try and grab him, try and get a little interview with him. Um, there's no one there, the people who go around with them. And they said to come down tonight basically. So I'm going to try and grab Grab them. Um, try and get an interview with Brian. I think he's out till from seven to last seven. So we'll just see what's what with him. See if he'll have a chat. Um, try and get his story. And if anyone else in the team wants to have a chat, I'll try and get the, the lads on who knows. Well, I won't say his name yet, just in case he doesn't want to. Um, also got a too good to go back to pick up from Greg's. I had two to pick up, but I couldn't make one from a Palm Bakery. So I cancelled it on a too good to go up. They still charged me for it. And then asked me if I picked it up and I said no. And he said they can't get a refund. So they're basically taking money for nothing off people that need it. Make it that what you will. Um, I've sent them a strongly worded email. So we've got a, ref uh, a response and a refund. Get across the rows. Yeah, so, yeah, I've got the next one to pick up. I'll have to get off here. Um, copyrighted music, I'll speak to back in a minute. I'll be back in a minute. I'm away from the copyrighted music now. Um, one issue I've got with this too good to go at the moment is early experiences are quite positive. But I've been to two st shops now, as I don't record them all. I've been to two shops now. I've been to a, a Greg's, I'm not going to say where they are, a Greg's and a Costa. But I haven't been to them before. So have you seen Greg's or Costa on here? It's none of them. Um, and I've been looked down upon when I've collected these bags from a Costa and a Greg's. Um, I'm debating whether to name is shame, the stores, because it's, it's not on. If people, you know, are down on look, like I'm, I'm getting them for other people, but if people are down on look, and then they get looked down upon for collecting a bag of food on a cheap, they're not going to go back, and they might not go back to another one. So, yeah, I, don't like, I, I didn't like that. Twice it's happened now. Right, I'm going to go up here. Uh, he's going to be off, um, sorry. Brian, Mr. Old, Old Orsley, it's going to be outside Primark now, so more music, got to speak louder. <laughs> I'm going to get copyrighted for this, aren't I? Um, yeah, he's going to be outside Primark, so I'm going to see if he's there. See you in a minute. I think I found a team. Uh, it's a table up here and some cars, so uh, I'll turn it around. I was tense here, and then uh, there's a group there on a the table. And there's the cars here. Of uh, volunteers by looks of it. So I'm going to try and grab someone and try and get a chat. See you in a minute. Right, hello everyone. So I'm with Brian here at the moment. Brian's going to, I'm just going to have a little talk, talk to Brian. So I'll put the camera on him because he's more important than me. Um, we'll get a little bit of a Brian's story and I learned about him and a little bit about him and his team. It's not his team out tonight. He's out tomorrow night. So he's inviting me to come round and follow him round tomorrow. So I'll be doing that and try and chip in if I can. Yeah. Yes, sir. Right. So, Brian, how are you? I'm good, mate, thanks. Yeah, good. You? Yeah, I'm, I'm not bad, mate. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I've, I've been pretty much inspired by what you do. Thank you. Because you've been on YouTube quite a lot on different people's channels and I've yeah, seen you yeah. quite a lot. And that's inspired me to get out and do something. You put your and, food brilliant, mate. And other, working, other people yeah. are being inspired now as well. Yeah. So it's, it's, it's good what you've done. So just tell me a little bit about where you've come from. Well, I was on drugs for like... 30, 35 years. Yeah. And I was almost living in uh, Old Orr Street in the doorway. And uh, I was lucky enough to go to Kingsway House. Yeah. Kingsway House. And, uh, yeah. I was lucky enough to go to Kingsway House. And I uh, became friends with Lawrence Kenwright and he gave me an um, apartment to live in there. Brilliant. And I, I started up the team, Mr. Old Orr Street's Kitchen Family, which is a team of volunteers. We're not a charity, we're just a team of volunteers yeah. that come out and do it for, 
for, uh, from our hearts, for yeah. no other reason, none of us get paid. We just come out and, because I've been there and I know them all on the streets. Yeah. They're all family to me, I don't see them as homeless people. Okay. I see them as my brothers and sisters. Yeah. yeah. So, the, the, the reason why I know about you is because um, you were in the Echo one time, weren't you? I was in the Echo, you had to call me the happiest homeless man, Liverpool. Exactly, yeah, exactly, because if people don't know who Brian is, I'll put a I'll put a I'll put a picture on the screen now of, of, of how Brian lived and how happy he looked living that way. So that's on the screen now. But you, it was at Christmas time and you had all. It was at Christmas decades. 2017 and yeah. I, done, I done my doorway up like a like a grotto. Yeah, brilliant. And yeah. The people from Liverpool when I come to the Echo just come to see me and brought me all kinds of that. And yeah. that's how basically I was started yeah. giving the stuff out because I was getting that much stuff to you. I couldn't yeah. couldn't keep it all myself. Yeah, no, that's brilliant, mate. So, you're, what, what team are you out with tonight? I'm out with Liverpool and Arms tonight. Liverpool and Arms. And, and your team uh, is That team, the team, Mr Old Orsley Kitchen Family. Mr Old Orsley Kitchen Family, OK. It's named after me because I, when I lived in Old Orsley, I had the top pattern suit, Batman you, suit tonight. You called Mr Old They called me Mr yeah, Old Orsley, yeah, so yeah, it's named after me, really. So, how long have you been doing this for now? I've been doing it for seven years now. Seven years, it's a long time, mate. It's a long it's, time, it's, yeah. It's, it's dedication, it, it is. is. Well, it, it, it's something I feel like I need. It helps me with my mental health state and all that as well. Yeah. You know, getting out here and helping my brothers and sisters. I've heard a lot of people say that as well, about, you know, it, it helps with their mental health. Yeah. State. Me, it, getting out at night and going for walks and, and doing stuff like this, it's good for my mind. Yeah, we've actually, we've actually started on the mental health uh, man's group, run by Joel's Goals, which is a charity. Yeah. Uh, that's big life for Liverpool. Right, okay. For, for men to come and sit together and talk and... Talk about their problems and all that, you know what I mean? Brilliant. Brilliant. We start on, it's on a Monday and then uh, Monday at 7 till 9. Whereabouts is that? It's at Big Life for Liverpool. Big Life. Where, where, where exactly? What, what's it's, the address of that? Because there are people. Number nine, number 9, Little Ancy. Okay. Li yeah. Little Ancy, that's right, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. So, but well, it's brilliant. Uh, we done our first meeting yesterday. Oh, that's brilliant, please. Yeah, absolutely. So, if people want to go along to that, they, they yeah, everyone's welcome. Men. Everyone. Men. It's a man's, yeah, man's yeah, mental health yeah. group. Men's mental health group. Everyone's more than welcome if you're male. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, Brian, thanks a lot for that, mate. Pleasure, yeah. mate, pleasure. I'll speak to you more tomorrow. Brilliant. When I'm well, you can around. walk around with it and make a video if you want. As, as, I need to learn, so yeah, I will, because yeah. I need to learn anyway. Exactly, and, yeah. And it, educates, it educates people yeah, on yeah. YouTube as well who, who don't know what to do. Yeah, yeah. There's a of people that have contacted me now saying, how can they help? Well, that's what it is. A lot of people don't know how to help. Yeah. There is loads and loads of ways people can help by like volunteering, donating stuff and things like that, you know. Yeah. It's, it's brilliant what people can do. Yeah. And it's, it's, without the people doing the donations and all that, we wouldn't be able to do what yeah. we do. Simple so, as that. So, so can you take cash donations, can you? Is, is there somewhere for someone to donate? Yeah, we do take cash donations. Uh, uh, Robin, one of my volunteers, does, I don't have nothing to do with money, not like that. Okay. I leave it all to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I'm just like the face, really. So, so is there an online donation? You don't have to do it. We'll talk about this tomorrow. Yeah, I'm yeah. Just wondering if he is. I'm just asking a question for me. I think we did have, we did have, a, we had one Christmas because Christmas time we uh, we done a big fundraiser and we had families Christmas with children and all that. Yeah. And we made like we made like over five grand. We give it all out to families with two different ways. Like brilliant. Okay. So uh, I'll let you get back. All right, my okay. mate. I'll follow you tomorrow. I'll go and have a chat with Craig. Craig, yeah. Craig, Craig, Craig well, yeah. yeah. So I'll have a little chat. All with right, my mate. Right. I'll see you tomorrow, Take care, mate. And you, mate. Right, so I'm here with Craig. Now, Craig's, a, Craig's an old friend of mine, so I'll introduce how we got to know each other in a minute, but I'll just get Craig on screen. As I, get, as I say, he's more important than I am. <laughs> Hope so. Yeah. Right, Craig, how are you? Oh, yeah, nice. I'm so, good, good, mate, good, mate, yeah. known each other around, what, 20, 20 odd years, isn't it? 20 years, yeah, easy, mate. I reckon, I left the army in 2003, and I started to work for Iceland not, not long after that. I'm you were a kid, you were a kid I'm 40, Iceland, so I was like, yeah. I was 20, 18. Yeah, then. Li li little youngster in there. Working in Iceland, I was doing security, you were doing um, like a shell stack and everything. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah on and on. Yeah, so, so what, Craig, what's this tonight? What, what what's it this? is, we're a team called Liverpool and Arms. We, yeah. um, we help the homeless on a Monday and a Wednesday. And we like get donation, like food. We go around places getting clothes. Just, right. play, just places in town where we've had like pizzas and stuff like that. So. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, that's good, mate. Good, good. Yeah. You've had problems in the past yourself, haven't you? Yeah, I have had problems with the yeah. alcohol and yeah, stuff no, like that. But you don't have to go right into it, mate. No, but yeah, yeah, but but I'm in recovery now. I've been in recovery for three years. But I, mate, yeah. that, that's fucking brilliant to hear. Yeah, yeah, so... So, yeah, no, made up, mate. So, um, what days do you use out? We come out on a Monday, Wednesday, between seven and half eight. Yeah. 
on the Monday, Wednesday, and there's a guy called Brian who works here. I've just spoke to Brian. I'm coming out with Brian tomorrow night. Yeah, are, yeah. are you out with Brian tomorrow night? I come out with Brian. Yeah, as so well, I'll yeah. be here tomorrow night with you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes, I said the following rounds. So donation wise, how can people donate? Um, they have to go on our website, um, Liverpool and Arms website. Um, what else can I ask you? You're saying it's quiet tonight because the cost of living payments going yeah, on in. Unfortunately, <laughs> mate, yes. We normally, like today, it's normally straight down the road. Yeah, I get you. Yeah. Yeah. We but, run uh, out. Well, the foods we let get, me, we let run me just, out. Let me just show the tables there. So there's there's plenty of, you know, there's plenty of people there. But, uh, but there's not plenty of takers today because no. they've been paid. Kev, which, I like to say, mate. It's so, understandable. We normally just run out of every food. Yeah. But now it's still, still loads there, mate. Yeah. No, it's, it's one of them meetings, you know. Yeah, yeah. At least the government's done something today for the change, mm -hmm. but they're not doing a lot else to help, are they? No. Um, going forwards, what do you, what would you like to see happen going forwards? I would like to cut down the people being on the streets, mate. To be honest with but you, that's, that, that, that's the end goal, isn't it? It's, it's like now, it's worse than what it was last year. Yeah. Last year it was now. There's new faces every see, day. I was talking to Martin for um, Martin. Yeah, I know Martin. <laughs> Got what scene's called? Action team. Action, action homeless for the people. Action homeless for the people. So I was talking to him, and he's been doing it for years and years. You know what I mean? And he said, you know, like I can remember back in the eighties. Yeah. People, people call people like this were called tramps. Yeah, tramps. But, but you rarely saw them. You don't you, see you, them. You don't you, come you, out. You, no. you didn't see them. You know, you see it, and it was the, it was the typical tramp. You know, he had a hole in his shoe, and you know, yeah, a woolly ass, yeah, and stuff, yeah, like, and stuff that. like that. Mate, it was yeah, the typical yeah, tramp stuffy, that you see yeah. on the films. Yeah, but, well, but you'd hardly saw them, so when you saw one, it's like, wow, it's Trump. You know yeah, what I mean? See but now, mate, it's, 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 it's turning bad, it's turning, it's a little bit of an epidemic in Liverpool, which, as it's I said to Brian, at the minute, mate, yeah. it's, it's fixable at the moment. But if it gets out of control, then, you know, yeah. the screws. Yeah, mate, yeah. Right, Craig, I'm going to let you get back to me, all right? Thanks, all right, for, thanks for talking to me. All I'm right, going to see you, mate, yeah. I'm going to have a little film around, and I've got a too good to go back to pick up from... Greg's in Primark, so oh, I'm going to hand that out to someone. Oh, that's yeah. right, Kevin, yeah. not well in, mate. Nice, nice one, mate. Nice one to Cheers, nice, nice one to talk to me. Yeah. So, just picked up a too good to go bag from Greg's in Primark behind me. And you know what, every time I go there, the girls are lovely in there, they're dead nice, dead. Uh, they don't make you feel like you're a burden type of thing, and they're dead nice. So, yeah, I recommend these a lot. Twice I've been in there now, twice I've been treated really nice, and I've got quite a quite a haul, so I'll turn it round. We'll go through what I've got, then we'll go and give it to someone, okay? So, first off, we have... That's a steak beef. Let's, go, let's have a look in the bag. We have a, a muffin. Right, these aren't named, so I'm going off touch here. They feel like two jam donuts. We have a... Looks like a chargill sandwich, doesn't it? Mexican chicken oval bites, okay? We have two more donuts. We've got loads in here. We've got a roast chicken mayonnaise baguette. Four super sausage rolls. And we've, in the bottom there we've got uh, two yum yums. Look at all that. For £2.59. You can't go wrong there. So I'm just going to put all that back. No. Baguettes. Oh, you know what? No. Let's put the sausage rolls in. Then a baguette. Donuts. Muffin. Steak bake. Sandwich and more donuts. So look at that bag, it's absolutely full to the brim of stuff. It's amazing, and the girls in there are so nice. So, yeah, if you want to go to Greg's, go to that one. Nice. Right. I'll go and hand this, I might go and hand this to one of the teams to hand out. There's a team behind me there called um, Sunday Supper Project. I've just been speaking to Corin. Um, I was going to do an interview this week, but I won't because I've already, I've already spoke to two groups tonight, and I, and I don't want to water down the exposure that they can get. So, 
I've done Craig's team and I've spoke to Brian as well. I'm going to go out with Brian tomorrow, so I, 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 as I don't want to water it down, so yeah. We'll do Corin next week and hello Corin's Nan, plenty, plenty of lots of videos. Thank you for watching. So yeah, um, I'll be back in a minute. Right, so that's me done in town now. Um, I've, I've been here quite a while, just not a lot of it's on camera because I've been chatting away to uh, a lot of people, learning things. I'll go down here, get out the way. Um, I'm meeting new organisations, which is all it's it's all about. That's why I want to do this. So I've been speaking to Craig from Liverpool and Arms, um, Brian, Mr. Old All Street, and. A new group called the Sunday Supper Project. Who I was talking to Corin, going to do an interview with there next week. Um, try and get uh, you know get as much exp exposure out there as possible. So yeah, I'm gonna leave it there. I've probably got enough to be going on with anyway. So what what I did do? I went yeah. So yeah, I've already mentioned it that I went to Greg's. Got I got the uh, too good to go bag. And I handed that to Corin because she had a lot of people around her. So I gave that to Corin to hand out for me. And there must be about 25 quid worth of stuff in there, in that bag. So yeah. A big up to Greg's Primark. That's a thing then. Yeah, but no. It's been good. Um, so Brian's really, you know, Brian's really good. You know, Brian's great. He's been there. Uh, He's wearing the t-shirt and he's making t-shirts to hand out to people so they can wear them now. If that metaphor makes sense. But yeah, no, he's, he's doing a great job. So I'm going to go out with this team tomorrow. Um, I'm going to film as much as I can of what they do, where they go and who they help. Okay, so thanks for watching. If you like the channel, please subscribe. Comment, let me know what you think about everything. Um, I've been taking on loads of um, advice from you all, which this is one of them. Uh, try and get involved with organisations, which I am. Get involved with as many as I can. So, yeah, speak to you all soon. Thumbs up, you all, don't forget. Bye now.